my families. Hi, Hi white kids. kids. So we are here today. Hi, white kids. Uh, Julius and Shakira and I are here today to read the Earth Book by Todd Parr. Todd Parr is one of my favorite authors. I take care of the earth because I know I can do little things every day to make a big difference. I use both sides of the paper and bring my own bags to the market because, check them out. Why do you think they bring their own bags to the market? Because they don't want to waste plastic bags. And they love the trees. And I want a place for the owls to live. Oh, look at that owl family living in the tree. I turn off the faucet while I brush my teeth and use less water for my baths because I love the fish and I want the oceans to stay blue. The oceans always stay blue. I take the school bus and ride my bike. That's a big bike. That is a big bike. Because I love the stars and I want the air to be clear so I can see them sparkle. Wow. Those are beautiful, those stars and the lightning bugs. I try to eat every bite on my plate and save my leftovers because I love watching things grow and I want there to be enough food for everyone. What did we plant this morning? Uh, um, uh, a seed. We did. We planted oregano and we planted basil so that we can, we can put it on our pizza. I remember to turn off the lights and shut the refrigerator to save energy because I love the polar bears and I want the snowmen to stay cool. I throw garbage in the trash can and recycle glass, aluminum, paper, and plastic because I love to walk barefoot in the grass and I don't want to move to Mars. What well, is Mars, Mom? What is Mars? Do you remember? It's a planet. It's a planet and you don't want to go there? Yeah, I'm pretty happy living on Earth, right? Yeah, well, we don't want to go to Mars because there's aliens there. <laughs> Maybe. Most of all, I help take care of the earth. Because, uh, because I'm responsible. You are responsible. I want us to all be happy and healthy. Look at that whole neighborhood of people and animals. And it looks like they're at the park. All right, at the end of a Todd Parr book, there's always a letter from Todd. Every one of us can help protect the earth and make it feel good. Remember, if we take care of it, it will take care of us. Love, Todd. Todd. So here's a story from Todd. At the end of this book, The Earth Book by Todd Parr, there's Stop a poster. Looking. Oh, it's okay. There's a poster, 10 Ways I Can Help the Earth. Okay, let's, let's read them together. Number one, I can turn off the lights. Number two, recycle. Number three, save my leftovers. Number four, be nice to the worms. Number five, share a book, like we're doing right now. Number six, plant a tree. We planted some plants this morning. Mm -hmm. Number seven, use, use both sides of the paper. Number eight, save water. Number nine, clean up trash. Number 10, put my underwear in the freezer when it's hot. What? what? Todd, you're a silly guy. So something really exciting is happening on Wednesday. Do you know what day Wednesday is? Wednesday's Earth Day, and it's actually the 50th Earth Day of all the Earth Days. So we are going to make a project I for... I want a present for Earth Day. You want to give Mother Earth a present? Well, recycling would be a great present to give her, and keeping the air is not polluted. So let's make a project. We are going to use shaving cream and paint. Um, we have some cookie trays, and you could use paper, or we're, we're using some recycling, actually. And paint mm -hmm. and shaving cream. Paint and shaving cream. So we cut up some circles from um, some cereal boxes. All right, so we're going to move over to the table. Come on over, Facebook friends. All right, so the very first thing that we're going to do is I'm going to give each kid a spatula. Because once I put the shaving cream on the tray, we want to make it really, really smooth. Smooth it, smooth it out. 
So my suggestion would be to hold it like this. Like a pencil? Like a pencil, kind of, yeah. So we can smooth it, smooth it, smooth it. I'm going to take off the top. And I'm going to put a bunch on, and then I'll tell you when you can smooth it, okay? I'm going to make some, some rows of the shaving cream. The fun thing about this project is when we're done with the art part of it, what are we going to do? Mama painting! Well, when we're done with the paint part, we can just play with the shaving cream. We really like to play with shaving cream at our house. <laughs> Remember we play with it outside? Well, we have played with it outside, that's true. All right, so you can use your spatula to spread it all out. Can I spread? Yep, you may. All right. Oops. All right, so spread it out. Use your, use your, um, yeah. So you want to make it nice and flat. So hold it like this so you can make it nice and flat. Like this. <laughs> okay, I'll okay. Like we're making cookie dough. Yeah, but we want to make it nice and flat like this. All right. <laughs> when you're done making it all flat, I'm gonna I'm gonna fill a cup of water and we can put the spatula in the cup of water. Nice job. Make it all flat. And then we picked out two colors of paint. What colors of paint did we pick? Um green and blue. Why did we pick green and blue? Because it's dirt day. And what is what is the green part of the earth? Oh, I know how to do it on another way because I made Okay, it. I'm gonna trade you a spatula for a paintbrush, okay? So we are making our shaving cream all kinds of flat. Nice work. Making it all kinds of flat. <laughs> then so we picked green and blue because these are the colors of the earth, right? The blue is the ocean. The blue is the ocean and the green, it's okay. And the green is the land. So I'm going to make, I'm going to put some paint on top of the shaving cream. And then I'm going to put some blue on top of the shaving cream. And then do you remember what we're going to do with the paintbrush? Backyard. We're going to use a paintbrush and we're going to make the paint. Um, Mix it. Yeah, um, we're going to make lines like this to marbleize it and lines like that. Don't go crazy. Just a couple lines, okay? Here you go. Oops, oh. that's okay. Shave cream's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Can you do not so crazy? Do spot do it like that? Mm -hmm. Alright, not so crazy. And then like I said, you could use some white paper. Um, we took some cereal boxes and made some circles out of them. And you let me know if you need more paint. I need more paint. Yeah. Why don't we use that paint? This paint is easier because I can um just uh pour it out. There you go. Spread it around. Nice work. How about oh. I just mix it around with the shaving cream? That's already on. Uh, it How about I make it rainbow? Mom? If you don't have paintbrushes, you could use um, a spatula, a knife, a spatula, a knife, a chopstick, a toothpick. If you have some toothpicks. All right. When you're done with your paintbrush, more. When you're done with your paintbrush, can you put it in here? Mm -hmm. More, more. No, you have a lot. My body did. It's fine. But I can't. Here, you want a napkin? Yeah. Yeah, so I have some napkins handy. And for my pants. Oh, we'll worry about your pants later. All right, so once you're done with your, with making your marble, I want to show our, our the folks at home. Mom, don't do that! It's not going to fall. <laughs> Check it out. <laughs> and then, what do you think we're going to do with these? Are we going to put the crazy side down or the, the cardboard side down? Cardboard. Mom, but I to... All right, so we're going to put it down. I'm going to flop it on, and then you can press it down. Not too hard, okay? Not too hard, not too hard. Ready? Yeah. Not too hard, not too hard. Push it down a little bit. Maybe tap it like it's a drum. No, no, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let me see, let me see. Oh, we need to tap it some more. So we had some open spots, so we need to tap it some more times. Make sure you tap it all over. Now it's getting try. Whoa! Yeah, yeah. So pretty! All right, so we cut out a bunch. Of, wow, Jules! Look at Julius's earth. We oh, um. So hold on. Oh! Ah! <laughs> it still looks amazing. We before we got on camera. Sit down, sweetie. Before we got on camera, 
I cut out some of these little red hearts out of tissue paper I to put, to put right in the middle of the earth, just like on the front of the earth book. Can I have some? Mom, can I have Check this? it out. Just wait. And there we are. All right, what do we say to folks at the end of our videos? Goodbye. Adios. 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 Bye, life families. We'll see you soon.